Right. How do you get Visual Studio Code, Visual Studio Code, Microsoft Visual Studio Code, onto your Mac? That's what this video is about. It's not hard. Let's do it. So, Brew, which you should already have installed, install Visual Studio Code. We'll let this run. And while this is running, I want to talk about it. So what we're doing is we're connecting to Brew's, you know, the missing package manager, separate video on that. And we're downloading that and we're going to do the installation. Um, a separate video about how to get the terminal, separate video about how to colorize your terminal with Groovebox. All those videos exist. Make sure you go out and find those. If you're having trouble, by the way, finding any of these videos in the order, please go to skillstack.io and look at the outline there. And you can see all the videos will be linked from an outline, um, which is much better than a, a playlist. Because you can go to that and then you can, you can look at everything. So there we have Visual Studio Code. Um, the thing to note about code uh, from the command line, whether it's Mac or Windows, and, and I'll just do this on both videos, is you can just do which code, and that'll tell you where Visual Studio Code is. We already talked about adding opt homebrew bin to your directory. Uh, if you don't know how to do that, and you need to do it for the first time, you can just do opt homebrew uh, brew slash bin code for your first time if you've never if you don't know about that uh, it might be by the way it might be opt user or user local on an intel machine this is on the m1 i mean the m3 so any of the arm ones so you hit enter and that is going to open up visual studio code down here and as soon as you have the icon down here you can right click on it and you can add it options uh keep in docker uh keep in doc and then that way you can run it there anytime so um, running from the command line is, is nice, and I'll do a separate video just about the things you can do by using the code command from the command line. Another way to start this would have been, um, let's go ahead and exit it. Another way to start it would have been to do command space and then type code, Visual Studio Code, and then type enter, and that would do exactly the same thing. Um, and you can go ahead and do the same thing, keep in dog. So those are the two ways to get Visual Studio Code onto your Mac using Brew. All those other videos are there. See you later.